I love the expression, when you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. That is often the case when it comes to the richness of the discussion and the commitment to action generated within the management meeting. By simply using a different vernacular can have a significant impact on the level of engagement and the understanding within the team. In most cases, our goal is to make more money and create superior wealth. If that is the case, why don't we present our performance that way? The one-page scorecard could be a significant difference maker. Let's call the income statement the money-making machine. And let's call the balance sheet our wealth creation engine. Now we're in a position to describe the integrated way in which we make money and create wealth. And yes, there is a measurement system attached. We call it the five chapters of our performance story. Essentially, what this allows us to do in chapter one is to establish how effectively are we growing. Then in chapter two, we want to understand how are we converting growth into superior profitability. In the third chapter, we now consider the effectiveness of how we have managed our balance sheet with specific emphasis on working capital. And then in chapter four, we want to integrate those three key drivers into the way we create cash. And lastly, chapter five is all about the way we create value as measured by our return on the capital that we have employed in our business. Now, let's think about the simplicity of what this presents. We convert our wealth creation engine into two areas, how we fund the business and then how we use those funds in terms of the investment inside our business, allowing us to understand how different decisions would impact our performance. So, for example, if our goal was to grow by 25%, not 20%, what would that do to our business? By simply pressing the net change button, we can identify how that additional growth would impact our performance. That means that if we could achieve that additional 5% growth, we would need to increase our revenue by $600,000. That would deliver an operating profit improvement of just over $100,000. Yet after that good performance in our money-making capability, our cash shows us that we still require $69,000 of additional funding to allow that growth to happen. Now this gives us already a great starting point in terms of what do we need to do to generate the profit that we required in relation to our growth and at the same time create a cash accretive business. Because at the moment, we notice that this business is cash absorbing. Now, if you consider this, wouldn't this give us a different way of driving performance within our management team? So why not consider giving your next management meeting a little bit of wow and witness the reaction? <music>